I tell you to stay away? From what? I don't even know who you are. Marguerite Maida's the name. You're on my turf. Great. Can I come in and warm up? What part of go away do you not understand, Altera? I'm not with Altera. to stay off my land. You trained that thing? Next time I'll let him tear you to ribbons, Altera. I'm not with Altera. I'm Robin Ayu. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my sea base. If you're not, Altera, why don't you disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Maybe once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. There's some junk on that table that might help. I couldn't get it to work. Blueprint synthesized. That far out to sea, swimming back for land wasn't an option. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction. And suddenly, there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink before or after I died of thirst? I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't going to die of exhaustion. Now, those Reapers, they're practically all muscle, but there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much, but I had that repair tool, so I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of Reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires, but as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's rib cage. Detecting bow of an astronautical Saltrans go vessel nearby. Vessel name Mercury 2. Inoperative. quarantined crew in the cave behind. We will be back for them. 
but we can't risk an unknown infection spreading through the mercury. We're packing survival kits for them, but there's only enough surplus for about two weeks. I'm telling them that we will come back. But I don't think I can land here safely. Twice. I hate this. But I have to leave them behind. I can't risk the entirety of the Mercury. Now I just need to build the test override module. Then I can disable that satellite tower. round. Come find me at my greenhouse. I'm about a kilometer east of your position up on an iceberg. I have a present for you. I'll come by if I have time. <laughs> sure. Whatever. If you have time for me in your busy social calendar.
satellite hasn't passed by in a while. I guess that was your doing. Sam's not the only one in the family who knows, knew, what to do with vague directions and old wire. She was an original, that sister of yours. First time I met her, I was sure she was all Terra through and through. Not a crease in her uniform. Sending those damn bird bots to spy everywhere. Then, she surprised me. Maybe a little too much. Meaning? If you really want to know, there's a PDA on the bench that can point you in the right direction. You need anything else? Don't bother me. <laughs> but you can help yourself in the greenhouse. The least I can do to repay you for getting those spine pests off my back. I've already synthesized an antidote and stashed it in a cave. I can go grab it and... That's your plan? You don't think it'll work? <sighs> You're thinking too small. Like maybe if you're polite enough about destroying the bacteria, Altera will come around and see it your way. But do you believe in yourself or not? I think so. You think so? Come on! Is a bacteria a threat, or isn't it? It is. Does it need to be dealt with or not? It does. So who's right on this? I am. Say it like you mean it! I am. I said like you mean it, not like you're testifying before a rigged transgov court. I am. Great. Then what you gotta do is seal off the whole cave. I've got just the stuff. Made it for fishing, but it blew the whole ice shelf halfway to deep space. Vaporized all the fish. Okay. And you gotta hit the lab too, or there's just no point. Actually, you know what? Let me take care of that one. It'll be fun. I have kind of a funny question for you. Have you picked up any kind of unusual interference during any of your robotics work? You mean like Parvin looking over my shoulder and telling me I'm assembling my circuits wrong because it's not how his dad did it back in the day? <laughs> no. Like electrical interference in the audio or video. Any kind of flickering or clicking. Huh, can't say that I have. Why? Oh, so it doesn't extend as far as the bay. What doesn't? When Fred was bringing me for my eval, we detected something, almost like an SOS. At Delta? How retro. What was causing it? I think architects are trying to communicate with us. You always think that. Look, it may be my job to always think that, but I'm very good at my job. Not that HR seems to care. I won't breathe a word of this to Emmanuel. Thanks. You're a good friend. <laughs> 